Okay, if you've been following along with the article, we've been discussing ways to get the most out of your hip-hop drum loops. And one way to do that is to instantly turn your drum loops into drum kits using Ableton's Slice to MIDI feature. Let me zoom in just a bit. So we've got a nice R&B drum loop here, and we want to turn this into a drum kit. So if I right click on my loop, I get a drop down menu, and I just scroll down and choose slice the new MIDI track. Now once I do that, I'll get a dialog box that pops up here, and it'll give you some different options. Um, number one is the size of the slices you want to create. So if I click on this Dropbox menu, you see I've got warp markers, transient, bars, 8th, 16th, 32nd notes, and that sort of thing. Um, for drum loops, if you want to get each of the individual slices within that loop, I recommend transient. So and then we have our slicing preset. Now this is more tailored around when you convert it to a MIDI, do you want some kind of effect on it? Um, and that sort of thing. You see some reverb, delays, you know, a slow riser. So for, for most typical cases, you'll just choose built-in. And then I just click OK. And this is the beautiful part. It's instantly sliced all these samples in this lick um, to a MIDI track for me. And you can see it pulled up a drum rack here and I've got all of my individual slices. So now I can play my own groove. So this is very useful, very effective, um, and can save you a lot of time, you know, so you don't have to bounce down one-shot waves, organize them into folders, and uh, then load them into your sampler. It essentially does all the work for you and gives you some different uh, presets as well to, to play with. So once you do that, you'll go ahead and you'll want to save this um, to your list. And you can see I've got a whole bunch of kits that I've made myself. Um, some OG kits, you know, some kicks, claps, some East, East Coast kits, Dirty South, etc., etc. So you just hit that little folder, and it'll allow you to name your kit. So I'll call this one Fly Kit. Now that I've done that, this kit will be available to me in the future, and I can use it anytime I want. So this has been a look at how to turn your drum loop into a drum kit instantly within Ableton. My name is Slick Nixon, and check us out at SiliconBeats.com.